On the second anniversary of her death, Portland police and family members need help figuring out who killed 19-year-old Logan Nettleton. We heard from her mom today and her continued plea to find the killer. Luxo's Audrey Wheel joins us live now with her message. Audrey. Logan Nettleton had just recently moved into her new apartment here near Southeast 174th and Powell when she was shot and killed in the early morning hours of August 30th, 2019. And today we heard the difficulty and pain from her mom and having just as many unanswered questions now as she did back then. I woke up to someone pounding on my door on a beautiful Friday morning. It was one of Logan Nettleton's friends who first told her mom what had happened in the early hours of August 30th, 2019. In disbelief, Maya Chamberlain drove to her daughter's home, the one she'd just recently moved into. I hadn't even been there yet. You know, she was still unpacking and um, wanted wanted to be settled before having us over for dinner. And so first time I saw my daughter's apartment, it was surrounded with crime tape and news reporters. Portland police officers arrived to Southeast 174th and Powell about 3.30 in the morning and found Logan had been shot. She died at the scene. Another victim, a man, was shot several times and survived. There was also a child home at the time who was unharmed. Officers didn't find a suspect. Despite their best efforts, I want to believe that everybody's working as hard as they can to solve this, but we, we don't have any more answers than we did that day. Chamberlain describes her daughter as larger than life. She was only 19, a young mom studying criminal and social justice at Portland State. She came to this life with an agenda and plans, and I didn't always know them or understand them, but she was the strongest, most confident, independent woman I've ever met. Now, two years later, Chamberlain and detectives are desperate to know who killed her. We know that there were people involved. We know that there are people who know things who haven't yet come forward. And your thoughts, your feedback, all of that is really important to us right now. Logan was an extraordinary person, and her son is just her shining light. And I just hope that, that our community will help me to have better answers for him when he starts adding, having harder questions. And there is a Crime Stoppers reward of up to $2,500 for information leading to an arrest. You can submit those tips anonymously through their app, and anyone with information is also urged to call Portland Police. Reporting live in Southeast Portland, Audrey Wheel, Fox 12 Oregon.